So this is the secret chamber. They're not ones for subtlety, are they? So, this is it. Hidden chamber of the cultists. Here, all along. I'm going inside. Keep my clothes for me. Best not to go in with your weapons, either. I don't think they'll look too kindly on that. How do I look? Terrifying. Good. Find me once you've found out the truth in there. Keep your wits about you. Try not to do anything rash. Me? Rash? Who thought these ridiculous costumes were a good idea? I think Demos hasn't arrived yet. Sorry, it's my uh, first time. A new recruit? <gasps> welcome, welcome. There's a lot of people here. All share our common mind. Good. We're here to evaluate the strides taken by the cult since the last meeting. We haven't met for some, some time. Where did they come from? The land and across the seas, we assemble as a community. Here, there is no war. There are no sides. You mentioned someone. Vimos. Who is that? You'll learn her name very, very quickly. She's our leader. I'm sure she believes that, but no. She's our weapon. She's difficult, but she does important work for us. I don't envy her position one bit. I'll go talk to the others. Thank you. Yes, yes, before Demos comes. Who knows if you'll get a word in after that. All right, then. Highest bid that gets an Olympic match You're not throw. listening. Forget the mother. She's useless. But I'm still not convinced. You. We need another opinion on this. Why split the resources searching for a woman we can't find? If we narrow our focus, Athens will be ours. Immediate threats have to be destroyed. Pericles has to be destroyed. Not without the mother. We aren't strong enough without the mother. Don't let Vimos hear that. If anything, we should be hunting the father. We know who the mother is. Looking for the father would be a waste of resources. What do you think? Hunt the champion's mother or her father? The mother. He's right. Get your priorities straight. Before you know it, Pericles will shore up his defenses and we will have lost our chance. Now, if you'll excuse me. I'll need much more information to identify who these cultists are. We need to look for the father. It's only blood right now, but who knows? Ramos may ask for our hands next. Go on, go on. Make your offering. We just have to keep our sights on what the bloodline will do for us. The bloodline? The mother, the father, the brother. You know, her kin. We need them. All of them. To use them? That information is not for Demos, of course. You know how volatile she is. She could rip through us easily. I'll be sure to keep it to myself. As you should. Nor can she know we're about to capture her mother. <laughs>
do what with her? I would lower my voice if I were you. Just know she will be put to good use unless she's uncontrollable. You know where she is? No, but it won't be long until we do, I assure you. She's the cult's next target. Tell me about Demos. She's shown us what we need to know. She's a machine, a weapon for the cult. Someone that unstable can't be trusted with such personal information. I have to go. To our great ambition. To ambition. to and from the cult. Gods, they have a foothold in every part of the Greek world. We're in more danger than I thought. yourself together, Malaka. You're a fucking pig before slaughter. I'll do it. I swear. I'll kill him. Let me go. You like to watch, you sick fuck. You're not just going to watch. You're going to teach this little insolent shit a lesson. Does he deserve it? Does it fucking matter, does it? What I say goes. No questions asked. I... I couldn't do it. But I'm not scared. Not anymore. If you can't kill a fucking Archon, what are you gonna do when I tell you to kill a fucking Archon? I will. I will. I'll kill Fidias. I... Show him what happens to cowards. They get fucking burned. Hand it to me. <laughs> no! No! <laughs> More? No. I'll go to Athens. I'll stake out the temple. I'll kill him. Good. And don't waste my fucking time again! Strange. I feel something now get towards the, the pyramid. The it's covered in shards. Like Alpinors. Ah, you had the last piece. Now it is ready. Every time I see it, it calls to me and sings of power. Does it call to you like it calls to me? It does. It's impressive. Yes. Show your reverence. What we have now is everything. Ira has blessed me. My great warrior is leading our army to victory. Can you imagine the pride I feel? 
Our champion will destroy our enemies before they even think to kneel. Mark my words. Elpinor is dead. One of you is a traitor. The artifact will expose them. You! Ah. Everyone will be tested. You first. Go. you. You're alive. They know me. My family. They want my mother dead. I see. It's worse than I thought. There's more. They have a weapon. What kind? A soldier. Stronger and more ferocious than any I've ever seen. Herodotus, it's my sister. We need to get to Athens. Athens? We need to find my mother. My clothes. Spear. Uh, uh, of course. My spear.
The cult of Cosmos called my sister, Mimos. She used an artifact to see my memories. Alexios, the man I serve, we must tell him what's happened before it's too late. You've heard the name Pericles before. Pericles is the great general leading the Thelian League against the Spartans. They say he's ruthless. We aren't leading the League against anyone. Pericles is a man of peace. This war was thrust upon him. Upon us all. A general who doesn't want war? Not likely. Save your doubts. He is working to end this war. We all are. If there are forces colluding against him, he must be warned. We have to go. You weren't there, Hirothodos. The cult controls everything. There's no stopping them. Which is why you cannot turn away. They want to destroy all of the Greek world with this war. I won't be some pawn in your scheme, Hirothodos. Don't do it for me, then. Do it for your mother. If there is one place where we can find information about your mother, it is in Athens. How? Pericles surrounds himself with the brightest minds in Athens, which is to say anywhere. In Athens, you can fulfill your duty to your family. But before we can go, I need you to meet me at the Lion of Leonidas, at Thermobile. Leonidas? Why? There's something I need to know. Something that may help us take down this cult and save your mother. You've proven I can trust you. But let's make it quick, Hirothothos. First Thermopylae, then we go to Athens. I'll make sure every single one of these cultists dies by my hands. You can't walk this battlefield without getting blood on your toes. If you close your eyes, you can hear them. Their final war cries. Before every last one of those brave Spartans perished. Their voices were silenced that day. But their story will be sung for an eternity. You didn't bring me here to talk about dead Spartans. What's on your mind, Rothothos? The Battle of Thermopylae still echoes in our hearts. But to stand here is to feel it in your bones. There is nothing here but ghosts. My concerns are with the living. Hold out your spear. My spear? What for? I need to know something.
Herodotos. I'm fine. I'm fine. The stories are true. That is the spear of Leonidas. The hero's blade. Where were Sparta's allies? The Spartans weren't alone in facing Xerxes and his hordes. Many from across the Greek world were armed and ready to fight alongside Leonidas and his 300. But when the mighty king looked into their eyes and saw fear, he sent them home. That sounds like madness, not bravery. It was foretold by the Pythia that Sparta would lose either its freedom or its king to the Persians. Leonidas made his choice. What happened to Leonidas after the battle? Xerxes was famous for honoring warriors who fought valiantly against the Persians. But Leonidas infuriated him so much, he cut off his head and impaled it on a pike. A bloody battle ensued, and his remains were reclaimed by the Spartans and buried here. Now, however, he rests where he belongs. In Sparta. What happened to the traitor, Hephialtes? King Xerxes paid him well, but treachery breeds treachery. A contract was put on his head, and he died as he lived. A coward. You knew this would happen. I didn't know, but I did suspect. There is a place I convinced myself was a dream. Until now. A peculiar structure on the island of Andros. Mysterious shapes carved in stone. Like nothing I've ever seen. You want to sail to Andros so you can show me shapes? In my travels, I heard whispers of an ancient civilization. A people who came before. Your spear and that place are connected. You mentioned the people that came before. Who were they? They were not gods, but they lived far longer than any mortal and were far more intelligent. I've seen carvings in caves, strange symbols that suggest it was this ancient civilization that created humankind and provided them with fire. But Zeus blamed Prometheus. Yes. Well, perhaps his eagle has been feasting on the wrong liver. The spear awakened to you, Herodotus. I trust you. You understand. I will do everything in my power to help you find your mother. I promise. But first, we must sail to the island of Andros. I'll meet you at my ship. Welcome aboard!